In this lesson, we are reinforcing the hours that Phoebe has spent on her riding posture and the application of aids. Now, when we apply an aid to a horse, we want the aid to be exactly the same every single time to have the same outcome. Now, this mare has a lot of issues in accepting the lower leg. And many people think that if a horse is moving forward and keeps moving forward a little bit, a goey horse, then you back off on the leg. Well, my principles are you don't. You don't increase the leg, but the mare has to accept the lower leg or she'll never learn because she'll always be fighting the lower leg. Now, Phoebe has spent hours training a core, training through the movement patterns that we use to specifically learn patterns of riding. And what we're concentrating on here is her lower leg, seat, hand, walk to halt, halt to walk. And the idea of what we want is that the mare learns the aid, accepts the aid, understands the aid, and gives us the outcome that we want. Now this mare likes to rush through the front end. She likes to duck her, ver her, her jaw behind the vertical. And what we've been using to uh, discipline that is to a little bit more leg. Now what's happening with that is the mare's getting a bit hysterical. So what we've done in this lesson is just seat, leg, hand, reward when she doesn't duck, give her a little tap with the whip, just a, a reminder of stay forward of the vertical, stay forward, don't drop. And we've just repeated the same aid, the same reward, the same discipline, and it's working exceptionally well. And we always finish off with true, long and low. True, long and low is the nose forward, not between the horse's leg. Phoebe has spent hours on her posture. We've also spent hours on understanding this mare's personality. We've now got a really talented rider training this mare long and low, slow and forward, and the outcome, I'm absolutely certain, is we're going to have a well-performed horse and rider.